How does Indian Navy's P-8I Poseidon detect submarines from the air? The P-8 Poseidon is an aircraft designed for long-range anti-submarine warfare, anti-surface warfare, and intelligence, surveillance and reconnaissance missions. It is capable of broad area maritime operations. It is a derivative of the next generation 737 to 800. It combines superior performance and reliability with an advanced mission system that ensures maximum operational capabilities in the future battle space. The P-8I aircraft is based on the Boeing Next Generation 737 to 800 aircraft. The forward section of the under fuselage houses an internal weapons bay. The wings are fitted with hard points for carrying air-to-surface missiles. The aircraft measures of 39.47 m in length, has a wingspan of 37.64 m and is 12.83 m high. The maximum takeoff gross weight of the P-8I is around 85 tons. In 2009, India signed a 2.1 billion US dollar deal with Boeing for the supply of 8 P-8Is to replace the Navy's aging Tukolep 2142M surveillance aircraft. Each aircraft has an average cost of about 220 million US dollars. In late 2010, Government of India approved the purchase of four additional P-8Is, bringing the total number of aircraft to 12. India plans to order another 12 P-8Is at a later time. The P-8I aircraft can fly at a maximum speed of 789 km per hour at a maximum altitude of 12,496 m. The aircraft has a maximum range of 2,222 kms with 4 hours on station. This exceeds the Navy's requirement in the request for proposal, RFP, that asked for a radius of action of 600 miles with a time on station of 6 hours. The range can be further boosted by mid-air refueling. The flight crew of the P-8I comprises of a pilot and co-pilot. However for missions, it needs an additional team of 7 to monitor the radar and weapon systems. The cockpit is integrated with primary flight display, multifunction displays, identification friend, ORFO, IFF flight management system and stores management system. The P-8I is intended to conduct anti-submarine warfare ASW, and shipping interdiction and to engage in an electronic intelligence ELINT, role. This will involve carrying torpedoes, depth charges, slam ER anti-ship missiles, and other weapons. It will also be able to drop and monitor Sono boys. The aircraft is equipped with a CAE and slash ASQ-508A Magnetic Anomaly Detection MAD, system, APS-143C, V, 3 multi-mode radar and a global version of the Raytheon APY-10 surveillance radar. The APY-10 radar provides precise information in all weather, day, and night missions. The internal weapons bay can house Mark 54 torpedoes, depth charges, and free fall bombs. The underwing hardpoints can be armed with air-to-surface missiles. In December 2010, India requested a sale of AGM-84L Harpoon Block II anti-ship missiles and associated equipment. The Harpoon Block II carries a 226 kg blast-slash-fragmentation warhead. It can be fired against land and sea targets. Most aircrafts detect submarines using their magnetic anomaly detectors MAD. One thing that separates them from the P-8 Poseidon is that it does not have a magnetic anomaly detector. It uses, among other things, passive sonar via drop sono bowies to detect submarines. All submarines make some noise which depends upon the frequency of their electrical system. There exist gigantic databases of noises made by almost each and every submarine. This helps to distinguish between the types of submarines and their allegiance. These Sono boys are powered by ocean water activated batteries and self scuttle after a predetermined period of time. An aircraft may launch a field of Sono boys to detect and track a submarine and once the submarine is located the buoy field will be advanced in the proper direction to maintain contact with the target submarine. The Indian Navy has inked a deal to acquire four of these P-8 Poseidon aircrafts for around $1 billion. The Navy already has eight P-8 aircrafts presently. Currently, 
The eight aircraft are based at Inzrajali and are operated by Indian Naval Air Squadron 312A. Armed with deadly Harpoon Block II missiles, MK-54 lightweight torpedoes, rockets, and depth charges, these aircrafts are India's Hawkeyes over the Indian Ocean region IOR. It has achieved a number of operational milestones which includes participation in the search effort for Malaysian Airlines Flight MH370, the first successful firing of air-launched Harpoon Block II missile in the world, torpedo firing, and active participation in major naval exercises across the globe. With a maximum speed of 907 km per hour and an operating range of over 1,200 nautical miles, the aircraft will be able to detect threats and neutralize them if required, far before they come anywhere near Indian shores.